Hi everyone, today I'm going to introduce you to a new tool called as Matlab Soft. This tool is created in year 2020, so it's not a surprise if you have not heard it before. And I would like to discuss to you about a few things about video converting. Video converting is not simply rename the extension. Rename the extension doesn't actually convert the video file. First of all, the video right is actually it passed through a video codec. There are a few well-known video codecs such as 264, AV1, VP8, and VP9. Most of the YouTube video is encoded using VP9, which is compressed very well. There's no point to extract VP9 and re-encode it or compress it with 264. I'm going to show you what is the size of a VP9 encoded video versus a 264. Right now, as you can see in here, this video is VP9 encoded. VP9 encoded video is size at around 19.3 MB and 264 encoded video is size at 25.9 MB as you can see it's a huge difference in here so there's no point to re-encode VP9 into 264 so by default we don't actually re-encode VP9 and AV1 so I'm going to show you how to download Mac like so first so you open your web browser and go and search for the Mac like so official website so I'm going to type in Mac like so and then this is the official website and click on it then depend on your PC is 32 bit or 64 bit and down here got a few instructions that you can follow right now I'm going to show you from step by step if your PC is 64 bit I recommend you to download 64 bit because 64 bit actually can convert video a bit faster although the size is slightly bigger for bit so I'm going to download 64 bit as you can see you can you will show the power of the dialog to step it so you set the file then after you finish download you open it and then you can drag the folder to the press here I'm going to place in my desktop I'm going to close this and there are two ways to using Mac like so you can choose to download your own FFmpeg flavor for this one right FFmpeg is from Deron I have a FFmpeg flavor from Deron you can either use Mac like so or if you want to use with your own FFmpeg you drag this into here so you can start it to use this one then you will use the FFmpeg for Deron and by default right Mac Loser already come with its own FFmpeg so I'm going to use the Mac like so on FFmpeg like example if there's a few video codec is not supported by the default built FFmpeg right then there is the moment you want to try other flavors so I'm going to use FFmpeg of Mad like so. as you can see there is a file created so this file is for the FFmpeg of Mad like so. I'm going to close this one first and then here you want to convert TS right you press on this tab for example I have three compressed video in here so let's look at the video the thing is the TS play in VLC is slightly not smooth okay example if I want to look at the rope in here whether it's real or not example I jump to here I jump to here again I jump back again and as you can see there is a slight lagging behind sometimes it's working well sometimes it's lagging like just now I just don't like this type of lag an example if I want to scrub if I want to scrub sometimes it cause a few lagging and it depends on the video size as the video get larger then it will be harder to scrub another sample if I open this one in here as you can see there's a few lagging in here then that for me so what I'm going to do is I'm going to convert it to mp4 what you can do is either you want to click batch convert then click select ts if you want to convert all the video alternatively you can break all this video into the application like this and then if you want to put the converted file into the folder you take this one only you click select ts right now i'm going to show you first it will output the folder to where you want so right now i'm going to choose out okay i'm going to choose out folder and click ok then it will start converting as just now i have already converted the video it will ask me if i want to overwrite it and i say yes so i click y and press enter then press y and press enter again then press y and press enter again so right now in out i will have my converted video so as you can see in my out folder this one is mp4 video so let's play it again very nice very very nice right now i can play the video without any lagging anymore and i can scrub very easily For example i click on the blind fall video again right now if i want to scrub compared to just now can you see how smooth this is under mp4 format and there are a few tools available in the mat like so example video joiner if you want to merge ts right what you can do is example this time right i'm going to output to the pre-processed video folder which means right it's going to output in the same folder in here so example if i'm going to merge these three video so I drag it into here. So I click combine. Then it will show the message. Please read through it. And here is the video. Okay. So let's open it. This one is the combined video. As you can see, if it's combined properly, right, then it's going to play the full length video even if it's different dimension. And sometimes it may not work because of a few errors. 
then you can choose to remove the one because the video in here is different dimension sometimes it may not work so let's say i am going to remove this one as you can see this video might be a bit corrupted as there's no icon so i'm going to remove it i press delete so let's combine it again right now um, this one is the old one so i'm going to delete this one so let's open this one this one is the newly converted video as you can see the true video is now much properly so if you want to compress this video right one thing you can do is you can bring things to mp4 converter then you can select your compress format i'm going to say average video since i don't need it to be very clear and then i'm going to keep original video so i drag it into here and press compress so this is the duration is and this is the speed and after you finish it then you can start to play it again and right now you will have the same resolution and your video is combined so let's see the before compress side before compress this ts format is 17 mb after compress the video format is 4.56 mb is that i hope you enjoy this tutorial and i hope you learn how to compress video and convert video and compress video can be easy with the right tool and i put the link in down the description below if you like it help me to share this video Put a good comment and help me to like the video. Thank you. I'll see you next time.